seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. So are you listening? Ricky J Sports. What up, my fellow YouTubers? Happy holidays. Big Daddy Cools out there. I am using Fabricio Verdum right now. Yes, we are leaving the welterweight division for now, and we are entering the heavyweight division, and I am Fabricio, and look at this. We're facing Daniel Cormier, and it seems like everybody that uses Daniel Cormier is a beast, man. I've never faced a bad Daniel Cormier in a long time, so here we go. Oh, man. And <laughs> you know what's so funny? You guys were giving me great tips about guys like this guy that I'm facing right now. And you said, don't kick. It leaves you vulnerable for the takedown. But that's okay. When you're using v Fabricio Verdum, man, you're good in all areas, especially even when you're on your back. And look at this right here. Oh, this guy has no stamina. Oh, and he still blocks that takedown. I thought for sure I'll get that takedown with all that stamina. But here we go. This is a chess match, people. This is definitely a chess match. Nice jab. Good leg kick by and you could tell. I'm looking to punch a little bit more. But see, I like using range. Oh, this guy's looking to take my head off. Oh, yeah. Belly tickling time, baby. Oh. I should put a link in the description. No, a link in this video. How belly tickling all started. It was the Roy Nelson video. I'll put a link, baby. A nice little card. And this guy, oh, he's doing all right, but his punches seem slow. Oh, that stunned him. See, when he's stunned, I don't mind kicking. And I'm just trying to touch him. Oh. Man, I gotta watch my stamina here. And I feel like right now I'm getting the better of this guy right now. See, I'm not one to use load up on huge shots. See how he's loading up? And you could see that from a mile away. But don't try to block those crazy punches, man, because that it still takes away from your from your arm strength. Try to sway out of the way. Yeah. Ah, Cormier, those big chicken kicks. <laughs> so right now, I feel like, oh, I feel like I'm doing all right. Oh, who's your favorite heavyweight to use in this game? I'm telling you, I love Verdum. But with the heavyweights, you got to watch out. Their stamina goes down like a leak in a boat. <laughs> a leak in a little paddle boat. You only have 10 minutes. So I'm, I'm careful because I'm waiting for this guy to shoot. I'm keeping my distance. Oh, wow. Oh, definitely my round, baby. Definitely my round. Here's a oh. perfect kick to the body. So now if this guy was smart, he knew or he knows Here's that I outclassed him on the feet that first round. So I'm thinking he's probably going to either clinch me or go for a takedown. So I got to be ready, man. You can't be robotic when you're playing this game. You, it's, it's like chess. You got to be thinking a couple moves ahead. So let's see if this guy changes his offense. Oh, man. Oh, he's coming at me. That bruise on his torso is getting much worse. Ah, yeah, baby. <laughs> he didn't think I was going to go for that. Oh, I thought I denied that. I totally denied that. And he's just waiting. And again, I'm comfortable being on my back with Verdun. And I'm content with just staying here, waiting for his move. And he's content too. Ah, baby. You can't just lay there like a warm blanket. Let's go. Let's fight. See, he's trying to, he's waiting for his opportunity to hit me when I have less stamina. So I got to be aware. This guy's very patient. Man. 
body has been proven to He's be not just bum rushing me. Oh, but you can't be too patient, big guy. You can't be too patient. And down he goes. The patent belly belly up high. And it's over. Yeah. What a win. The guy was too patient. Let's get in another fight. Hang on, big daddy. That was a huge right hand for the victory. Oh, baby. Tyson, Tyson, Tyson. I love facing Mike Tyson. It's not every day that you face somebody using Mike Tyson because you have to, you got to either purchase him, I believe, or win, uh, beat the career mode. So here we go. <sighs> I believe that's how it is. You got to win. Yeah, in the career mode, I believe. Yeah, so here we go. Or you got to buy him. But anyway, let's try to get a win. Oh, what a little... That is not good sports personship, people. You see what he just did? And this guy's talking. Oh, yeah. And the thing is, against a Mike Tyson, you got to utilize your distance. Tyson's short for the heavyweight division. So I'm careful because obviously he could take you out. Look at those punches. He could take you out with his crazy punches. So I'm trying to keep my distance. Kicks, baby. Kicks and counterfight. Oh, he's looking at the kick. <laughs> little chicken wing kicks there with Tyson. And look at his stamina. Tyson uses a lot of stamina with respect to his kicks. He's not used to doing that. Use what is going good for him, and that's his, his punching. And already I got him backed up in a corner. Cutting him off. Oh! Is he going to... He won't dare to come down. Oh, he's chopping at my leg. Oh, and again. <laughs> it's like for dooms. <laughs> Wearing high heels for the first time. Let's go, baby. <laughs> that, was a bad, that was a bad analogy. Bad analogy, but I'm nervous. I'm not used to Tyson. Who would have thought that Tyson would be taking out my legs? Switch stands. Looking for an angle. Oh, he's speaking a different language. Oh, and he blocks the takedown. But this is good for me. I'm enticing him to a ground battle. I like this. I like this. Because you don't want to be messing around with a guy like Verdun. Even though he's on top. Baby, reverse a Rudy. And look at his stamina. He's got nothing. He's got nothing. And that's another little telltale right there. If you ever want to go, if you ever wanted to go to a mat, the mat, and look at this, this could be over. Shoot for that takedown. Don't worry about getting stuffed and reverse it. And this guy is probably regretting playing around with me on the mat, and it's over. A gentleman finish. <laughs> you see how I didn't go for the punches? Oh my gosh. I am on a roll, man. I think I've won 14 or or so straight fights, man, in this heavyweight division. I am kicking butt and taking names. Feeling good. And here we go. This is obviously another Overeem. And he touches gloves. Let's see if he blitzes me like that previous Overeem. He's coming at me. And he is. You look at him. He's coming at me even more. <laughs> so I'm nervous. Oh! So I'm careful against Overeem. But look at his stamina. It's going down already, dude. And he's chopping at my legs. Oh, look how quick that takedown was. I'm not going to mess with this guy. Oh, man, good on him. So now I got him thinking. <laughs> look at how I'm just pressuring him. So now I got him thinking. Oh, he's throwing punches with half stamina. Not good, brother. Not good. You got to wait. Patience. Oh, and he's hurt already. I gotta be patient. Don't wanna blow the wad. And he's hurt up top. Oh, down he goes. Is it over already? Oh my gosh, guys. I can't believe it, man. I'm on a roll. What? This is crazy, man. This is crazy. Let's get in another fight. Come on, baby. Hang on. Oh, wow. Now look at this, man. I have no advantage. Everything is straight up, man. It's a pick em fight. So I'm nervous right here because now if it goes to the mat, it's all about pure skill with the controller and reaction time. It's not about Fabrizio Verdun because everybody's even here. So this will be the last fight. So let's see what I could do. 
And again, if I, when it's Verdum versus Verdum, I'm nervous, man. So let's see what we could do. So I am in blue. <laughs> oh. Oh, man, he wants a strike. And again, you know the guy's probably going to want to clinch or go for a takedown. Oh, look at that. Oh, man. See, I don't like those crazy strikes. I prefer quick strikes. Quick strikes and kicks. Oh, is that elbow legal? Come on, Mario. Doc points, man. He's going 12 to 6. Oh, he thinks he's Jean-Claude Van Damme. <laughs> Wow, this guy's really tagging me a bit. I gotta stop kidding around here. Stop kidding around and let's pick my spots. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, you kick me, I kick you. Yeah, I gotta mix it up. Definitely have to mix it up here. Oh, he's doubling it up on the body strikes. Joe, that was well done, the punch. See, I gotta be patient. I gotta keep my stamina up. Good roundhouse kick to the midsection. Man, I've never seen a guy double up on the body kick, so this is different. He's done it twice, though. Wow. See how much ground he gained with that elbow? Yeah, go. Man, I was trying to go to the body there. Yeah, that hurt him. Oh, he's backed up. Oh. <laughs> and again, I'm trying to keep that his stamina down. Keeping the pressure. Keeping the pressure. Yeah. Yeah, come at me. Yeah, this is this is this hurts him, man. When he's taking shots with half stamina. And there he goes doubling up on the body kicks. Do not recommend that. See, that's not going to hurt me if I have full stamina and he doesn't have full stamina. There he goes, doubling it up. Nah. Oh. <laughs> feeling confident, feeling good. Nice. I don't need to finish it here in the first round. Nah, you can't shoot from Timbuktu, man. Don't work. I love that strategy that you guys were saying. When you kick, you leave yourself susceptible to the takedown. And I'm aware of that. And now you know how I fight? Every time a guy is potentially a takedown artist, I try not to kick too much. And that's helped me not get taken down. And this guy is now getting mounted. And I'm gonna try to delay a bit. Delay a bit with my shots. Oh, he's hurt, man. He is hurt, he's not moving. Oh, baby. What a way to finish it off. Awesome stuff using Verdum, man. Like, oh, I can't believe I won all those fights. Like, I don't mind posting. You guys saw me lost, lose before. I don't mind posting me losing, but I am on a tear with Verdum, and I'm loving this. Let me know in the comment section below who you use with respect to the heavyweight division, man. This is fantastic. I'm going to continue my streak offline and see how I do. <laughs> man, so to recap, wow, I went on like a 25-fight win streak. As you could see in the picture on the screen, Fabricio Verdum is a beast, man. So let me know in the comment section below your experience using Verdum. He is awesome awesome man and i will post other videos of other fighters in different divisions let me know who you want to see and i'll do a nice little let's play like i did in this video and we'll take a break from magni just for a little bit but you'll see magni again anyhow people this is ricky j baby from ricky j sports and you are awesome